regular day in the lab, my time in the lab involves instrument repair or setup or something of that nature. But the day in the life of the lab of others is typically uh, partially wet chemistry, uh, partially instrumental analysis, and then partial uh, data mining and, and data processing. The role of the Metabolomic Center is to provide large-scale biochemical profiling of metabolites uh, from various uh, species. And we use that to understand what's going on in the plants, algae, microbes. Uh, we have a 600 megahertz NMR. We have multiple UHPLC QTOF type of instruments that we do LCMS profiling. We've bought a new GC QTOF, which we'll use for profiling as well. And then we have some targeted tools such as an LC triple quad. The research focus of my group is uh, the development of large-scale biochemical profiling technologies uh, focused on metabolites. We develop the tools and the analytical instrumentation, the methods and resources uh, that go with that, but we also then apply that to a better understanding of plant biochemistry. We're trying to understand how plants produce specialized chemicals that are important in defense. And so if we can understand that uh, process, we can actually begin to in engineer plants with improved yields, improved fitness, improved quality in the field and in agricultural production. But the same tools that we use for studying plants are very applicable to studying other organisms, uh, whether it's bacteria, uh, whether it's humans, whether it's animals. The truth is there's a very limited number of metabolomic centers uh, throughout the U.S. and really there's no national plant metabolomic center and this is part of our goal is to develop a national center of excellence uh, focused around metabolism and we'll have a slant on metabolism but the University of Missouri is unique in that it has uh, a large agricultural group, a large vet medicine group and a large human medicine group and so uh, although we have an initial slant on plants uh, we plan to expand this into the study again of, of all species.